Hello friend. It's been a while since I've shown off my projects. It looks like a lot, but really it's not. I must have crafting ADD. I cannot focus on anything. Um, let's start with spinning. I've got, I've done a lot of, actually, a lot of spinning. I'm using Shein bags. I don't know. But I think I messed, usually I take the braid and I split it in half and just do half and half and two-ply it. But for whatever reason, when I ripped out the, or tore, I separated the braid, I got like four different pieces. So I'm not really sure how this is going to get plied together. But it's turning out pretty well. And then I started embroidery. I have not done this in forever. This is like a kit. I think it came from Michael's, maybe in one of their grab box things. So I've been working on that. And then the only, well, this is not actually the only thing I finished. I forget the pattern. I've lost it somewhere. It's just a garter stitch bear. It's made pretty much in one piece. And then you sew it together. So I kind of like the stitching like that. It's kind of cool. You're supposed to embroider the face, but I did buttons. I don't know what I'm going to do for the mouth. And the ears, it more looks like a cat because you don't really put ears on it. So you make just one big piece and I think you pick up and for the arms, I can't remember. But he's cute. He's quick if you sit down and do it, which I did not. But I did use some scraps, so that's pretty good. And then I had started the bag, you know, the $1,400 bag. Well, we all know I'm not going to finish that. So what I thought I got, and this is now I see not going to work. I got like a little makeup bag from Dollar Tree, and I was going to use it for the lining and then just kind of figure out how to, like, I don't know, glue it or sew it so I wouldn't have to actually put in a zipper and crocheting. But I see now that this bag is not going to fit. So that may be another thing that just doesn't get done. Who knows? And then, okay, so in using up my book, going through the books, I found this book. I I don't know. I It's got a lot of cute patterns in it. A lot of them have... Um, graphs, charts, which I can never follow, but I don't know. And it's so easy to make them on four, on, you know, on four needles that I, I don't know that I would do this. I am making these because I wanted to try it with fingering weight yarn because I had made, I started with, what did I start with? Oh, oops these ones which are where's a picture of it i don't know weight on worsted weight yarn there they are okay so i did make those now i don't know how i guess you would wear them as slipper socks because i don't know how the seam is on the side so i don't know this one worked up real quick but it is acrylic worsted weight yarn and I have, and they do fit. They're just a tiny bit too big. But I guess you would, I don't know if you would wear them in shoes. But anyway, so then I, I knew there was no way I was going to be able to make a whole sock in sock yarn. So I did do the baby sock. One's done. Well, I need to sew it. But it's done. And I was right. It's pretty boring. It's taking a long time. I'm not all that interested. The yarn is, I think it's box store sock yarn that we dyed. I don't know. Anyway, and then, oh, I've started, it's called the Strawberry Baby Hat. And this is the top. And now I have to attach the red and some beads. I don't know. Again, it's another thing that got left. And then I had to be in the car for a real long time. So I thought I'd start another bag with yarn that I have left over. See, I'm using up yarn. Just made up the pattern. I'm hoping it'll stand, like be open, like have a bottom. I don't know. We'll see if it actually works the way I think it will. And then the granny stripes blanket. I ripped it out. I didn't like it. I don't know what was wrong with it. It wasn't working out. 
Maybe it was just that it was so huge. And I started another one, which I have. It's the granny stripe blanket pattern. Anyway, so I have restarted it. I'm still got this much left of the what I had already ripped out. So I must have. But this is a lot shorter. So it's going a lot quicker when I work on it. And I have been reading. I'm reading Hillbilly Allergy, which I like. And then this is where I, in between them, this is where I write down. I have a book log. I read two. I read Fondant Fumble and The Diva Goes Overboard after I finished reading uh, Lies My Teacher Told Me, which, oh my gosh, that book would not recommend unless you have to teach history. Then it would be really good, or unless you really love history. Let's see. Nothing else is going on. The garden is growing. We have tomatoes and cucumbers. The celery that I started was from the bottom of a store-bought celery stock, celery bunch. Started to grow, and then I don't know if it died off or something ate it, but it is no longer there. But anyway... Here are all my projects. So this is it for the day. Bye, friend.